in Indian illegally occupied Jammu and Kashmir, Indian troops, in their fresh act of state terrorism, martyred one Kashmiri youth in a fake encounter in Srinagar. The Indian troops and paramilitary personnel brought the youth and killed him in a fake encounter after they switched off the Bagura grid station, the eyewitness told media men. In the weeks following the February 1 military coup, many civilians joined millions across Myanmar in peacefully demonstrating for a return to civilian rule. They are training to kill soldiers with a wooden haunting rifle in the jungles in Myanmar's southwestern border. We have conducted nationwide protests and launched a civilian disobedience movement against the military in hopes of restoring civilian democracy, but those methods alone didn't work," said Nino, a former university lecturer who is now leading the political arm of a civilian resistance group. We have done everything we can and taking up arms in the only way left to win this," she added. Shopping brand Zara's head designer is receiving flag on social media for her Islamophobic comments. She defended Israel and blamed the victims in Palestine for the violence in Gaza. Following the leaked conversation, thousands of people lodged complaints to Zara against her head designer. Reluctant to take action against the designer, the brand said, Model Kahar Harsh has accepted the spontaneous apology. The male model against posted the screenshots of the brand containing him to post online the apology by her head designer. Saudi Foreign Minister shed light upon the brotherly nature of Pakistan-Saudi Arabia bilateral ties and how their cooperation issues relating to Islamophobia and the OIC platform could be used to safeguard the interest of Muslim Ummah in the global community. He explains the importance of improving bilateral relations through increased investment and economic opportunities between the two countries. The helium-filled balloons, which were affixed with incendiary devices, were floated into Israel. The idea says that balloons were launched as a protest to the proactive flight march in Jerusalem where thousands of Israelis marched through the old city. Far-right Jewish extremists taking part in the prayer chanted, Deaths to Arab, and this is our home. Israeli police in rights gear blocked surrounding streets, forcibly removing Palestinian protesters from the route.